God bless you. This is the month of August. We want to invite you to come and be a part of this dynamic ministry. Our weekly program includes Sunday morning, Sunday school beginning at 9.30 a.m. with prayer. Sunday school is always in order. We teach here that a child saved is a soul saved plus a life. Come and be a part of our Sunday school ministry. We offer classes from uh, infancy all the way to adult. So we have so much planned for you. Once again, that's Sunday school, Sunday mornings beginning at 9.30, followed by our morning worship services that begin at 11.30 a.m. Our weekly discipleship starts off during the week, Tuesday through Friday mornings beginning at 9 o'clock with prayer. Prayer is always in order. The word says that men ought to always pray and not to faint. If you would like to come and be a part of our prayer service that begins once again Tuesday mornings uh, through Friday mornings at 9 o'clock a.m. On Wednesday we have dynamic Bible teaching by our very own pastor and bishop, Bishop Roosevelt Dunn. He covers very relevant subject matter for the times in which we are living in. So please come out and be a part of us. Once again, that begins with 7 o'clock prayer. On Thursday evening, we have music training with our Greater Israelite Choir that begins at 7 o'clock p.m. On Friday night, we have a plethora of schedules depending on which night of the week. But we do realize that on second Friday is beginning at 7 o'clock there is leadership prayer listen to our announcements for the schedule Friday schedule will include a first third and a fourth Friday nights please come and be a part of our scheduling that takes us to Saturday mornings we do have dynamic ministries available for children and youth as well as the nursing home ministries on Saturdays between 11 and 2 is our sunshine band Sunshine Band begins from the time that they are potty trained and able to walk all the way till their 13th birthday. A child saved is a soul saved plus a life and that extends also to our Sunshine Band ministry. Also on Saturdays we do have a dynamic youth ministry beginning at 11 o'clock on first and third Saturdays. That is called our purity. Those who are in that age group once again have so much that they are exposed to in the world with the times that we live in. It is nice to bring them to a place that teaches them responsibility, teaches them structure, teaches them everyday living, instills good moral principles in them from a spiritual background and development. So we want to invite you to include your children in our purity. Also on Saturday mornings on 1st and 3rd, we do have a dynamic nursing home ministry. For those of you who are needing just a little bit of assistance, we also want to encourage you to come in around 9 o'clock a.m. a 9 to 11 as we have our open hands pantry ministry for those who are in need. These are your announcements that we have for this week. Once again, uh, the week starts with Sunday school and we go into our morning worship. We have so many activities planned for this month as we are concluding with all of our summer activities. First of all, on our local church calendar, the first Friday prayer begins at 7 o'clock p.m. Greater things are wrought by prayer than what the world will ever know. We want to invite you to come out on our first Friday night, that is August the 7th at 7 o'clock p.m. Our jurisdiction calendar includes a fellowship banquet that is August the 6th. We also have the Pastors and Elders Council August the 13th. Also August the 7th through the 14th is our 95th annual Holy Convocation. It is a time of in-gathering for all the saints to come in for those who are in the Colorado jurisdiction. Also, we do have our annual Adjutant Day on August the 20th. Our local calendar is also filled with a lot of activities, but we want to let you know that for our word of the month for the month of August is mighty. It is coming from Psalms 24 and 8. It says, Who is the King of glory? The Lord strong and mighty. The Lord mighty in battle. God bless you.